Parker Tibbetts Jr. says he got a late start in business. I was 10 years and nine months old when I first got into business. Mr. Parker came from Cayman Brack to Grand Cayman with very little, but he grew what he had with hard work and a liberal dash of vision. My dad's favorite poem was the Mary Gloucester by Rudyard Kipling. And his favorite line out of it is, they've copied all they can follow, but they cannot copy my mind. I leave them sweating and stealing a year and a half behind. I have taken that to heart from a very early age. Associated Industries Group began its life basically as a junkyard, which grew into car parts sales and today is the umbrella for Parker's Ace, AI Rentals, and Save the Date. He says it truly is one of his proudest achievements, success he attributes to business acumen and a belief system that he learned early in life watching customers being served in his grandparents' Cayman Brack store. I did my grade school homework on a, on a mom and pop store counter. That's where, that's where I was. That was what I learned is a way of life. Mr. Parker has been involved in so many different types of business enterprises, it's hard to categorize them. Let's just say he is a true entrepreneur, deftly getting in and sometimes out of a business at exactly the right time. I have built a reputation of moving quite fast and on businesses. He believes his success has customer service at its core. A lot of the businesses, I, I wasn't the first one to go into them. I just tried to run mine better than, better than any other one I saw. And uh, put whatever elbow grease it needed into it, too. Elbow grease and an impeccable sense of timing. It's been a winning combination for Mr. Parker and his businesses. Things have always dropped into place pretty quickly for me. As an early member of and supporter of the Chamber of Commerce since the 1960s, he's been a passionate advocate for the business community, serving as president from 1979 to 1982. And after his amputation due to complication of diabetes, he's shown us all that a disability may change your life, but it doesn't have to diminish your quality of life. My father's father was a diabetic. He rode his bicycle to work. He served his store. I learned that you, you have a a disability, but you can do things to work around it. Today he serves on the Disability Council, earning the Cayman Islands Certificate and Badge of Honor presented during the 2017 Queen's Birthday Celebration. Honesty is a big key in business. In fact, I will tell you that on my tombstone, I would like to know that they put here lies an honest gentleman. That's what I, that's what I would like to see there. And I've tried to, to build that reputation in all my years. Mm -hmm.